Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video, where tonight we are doing another Spookwood Hunt, where, um, uh, yes, your response to yesterday's video was amazing, okay? That thing that I said, where, I, like, first four hours, I'm gonna have a thousand views. You guys rocked it out, and there was a thousand and one views within the first hour, or first four hours. That's awesome. Um, a little sad that it was only lumber and not like any of the other videos, but that's that's fine. It's spooky season. We need to go do some spooky hunting, and I am in a nice server with very little fog. It's not. It's like the middle of the day. So, let's do this. Let's let's go. Actually, I should have probably stayed up there and looked around, but I've already done my looking, and I am ready to travel. Let's go traveling. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, <clears throat> Lots of people have been commenting saying, Code, I love your videos. I love that it's not just gameplay and it's not just this and it's not just... I, I know. <laughs> I made them. <laughs> it's me. I mean, it's literally just me talking on videos and hoping that like I, I hit a nerve with you or, or uh, I hit some kind of relational thing that helps you in life, I mean, I don't know why you're here. Only you can, like, explain that. <clears throat> I know why I'm here. And that's because I like playing video games and making videos. <laughs> and the other thing is I don't mind being on camera. So, that's that's probably the gist of it. And, and thank you so much for all the people who are like, Code, I love your beard. I love your hair. It's such a cool stuff. This, this was like a sudden choice of like I just want to grow out my hair I don't want to use a whole bunch of gel in my hair anymore so I let it start going and it turned out to be really nice <laughs> my uh, my boss says yeah my sons say your hair has flow <laughs> I, I don't know what flow is that's that's a new term but oh girl he got good hair <laughs> uh, I don't know 42 and, and full head of hair. I don't I don't have any balding spots, which is good. There's no thinning of the hair. It's nice and nice and thick. But I have the expectation because my dad has three brothers, and those three brothers, one of them kept his hair. So I mean, there's a 50/50 chance I could could lose all my hair. Who knows? Give me until like 77, and then and then we'll look at my hair and see if it's gone. If, it, if I still have hair by 77, that's how old my dad is, by the way. If I still have a nice, big, full hair, head of hair and everything else, I don't know. I'll be lucky. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to be looking that way, too. Oh, dang it. Okay. Okay. I didn't miss anything. I'm still looking for the spook trees. Uh, this right here is a really good spot on top of those rocks right there. That's usually where one will appear. But um, just so you know, a spook tree can appear on any surface. I think the only one that they're not allowed to grow on is, is road, maybe. Um, but all the rock surfaces, all the ground surfaces. I wonder if there's a part that Defaultio may have overlooked or missed or something. Like the uh, the controlling pink boxes, right? The ones that control the bases and stuff. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, there's three pink orbs inside Wood Art Us, and that actually controls the uh, the bases and their physical properties, I think. But it would be funny to see a spook tree growing out of the top of Wood Art Us. <gasps> no! Skills. Just because uh, it has the ability to, like, spawn anywhere. I wonder if it has the ability to spawn on one of those objects. I wonder if it's easier going up the path backwards. I bet it's not. Here. Let's zoom in get a good, good first-person kind of perspective thingy going on here. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa keep those tires on there no. oh that was so close
Woo! Skills. Alright. Like, I don't want to wait around. Let's get up there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright. Take a peek. Not seeing anything. I might have to go over there and, and so I can see the uh, backside. No, just a bunch of dead trees. We'll have to do an ice run here shortly. I've uh, I've got six mil on me, but I need to show you guys how to make some money. By the way, uh, a lot of people have been asking me, hey code, how do you make a lot of money? There's two methods to my madness that I like doing. Grab yourself a trailer, or a car with like some trailers, park it down at the bottom of this thing, and just start chucking as much ice wood as you can down. Have somebody else at the bottom picking it up, and selling it off, chopping it up and stuff. But if you have two people running back and forth with the ice wood, one person up here just chopping wood, tossing it down, I mean, that's a that's a great method for getting lots of money really fast. Um, okay, let's go, let's go check out the cave, ooh, cave of wonders. For those of you that didn't know this was here. Whoa. I thought it changed songs for a second. Can you guys see? Okay, I don't know if you can see or not. Hold on. Oh yeah, you cannot see at all. <laughs> all right, uh, Roblox, right click. Filters, color corrections. Oh gosh, that's horrible. Contrast, gamma. This is not working. Oh gosh. Whoa. Whoa, there we go. Kinda. Turn that brightness down, turn that contrast up. Brightness down, contrast up. Brightness down. Oh, look at that. Contrast up. Brightness down. Okay. Well, hmm. here's what the filter looks. That's what the screen looks like normally. Here's with my filter on. A lot of you are going to ask me questions in the comments and be like, Code, how did you do that? This is a feature of OBS, okay? So what I'm doing right now is literally, I'm feeding the game into OBS. OBS is saying, hey, I'm, just, I'm capturing this display, blah, blah, blah. And then I'm putting a color correction over the game so I can see. So literally, like the game, I can't really see. I look over here in my OBS studio and I can see. So if you didn't know, this is the lighthouse from another one of his projects. Uh, doesn't look like anything else is in here. No spook wood, no spoopies. See, this is one of those things that kind of confuses me because Defaultio never does anything without like a reason. Whoa, hold on. Is that just a part or what is that? Yeah, it's just a part that's sticking out. Dang it. Hold on, can I do that shift lock thingy? Hold on, where's settings? Okay, that is just a piece that's sticking out. Just another thing that was built. Wish I could see that direction, I can't though. All right, what about through here? Can we see, that's just that, okay. Let's go over here and take a look.
that's what it is right there. It's this brick right here. Hmm. see in there dang it all right <laughs> so now that we're back in the light I should be able to right click filters turn off the correction oh gosh now it's just dark it's just dark time <gasps> did I just get a beep beep is there a sound somebody somebody talking to me nope no messages okay <laughs> well shoot now it's nighttime and I'm not going to be able to see anything. And my nose is getting clogged. <laughs> Dang it. Oh. Stop. No, that's that's a lava. That's a fire wood. Lava wood. Lava tree. Okay. What is my last point of return where I, I won't be able to get back? I think it's this next... Yeah, so I can still get back over there, right? This is the cove, by the way. If you've never been over here to the cove, this is what they call the cove. And I say they, it's us. We call this the cove. I keep saying, like, that's something I just realized. Like, I keep saying they. They say this. They say, it's us. We say this. It's not a they thing. Get out. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car, please. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. Now I can turn and turn. One more. One more. One more. One more. One more. One more. Please. Why are you not turning? There it goes. <laughs> uh. All right, let's go off this direction. I don't think I can go back from this point. I think we are stuck. And I'm not seeing anything. All right, let's keep going. Skills. Now, if I jump in here, I'm gonna die. Can I, can I jump into the air? Come on, get out of there. There we go. All right, so <clears throat> I've done this before, but I don't know if you guys have seen it in a while. So check this out. If you do this just right, jumping off the edge into the water. So see how I'm dying, right? Ow. No. Code, what are you doing? I'm playing. Having some fun. If you ever want to explore and you don't want to die, just stay on the edge of the ocean. Oh, <gasps> can I stay down there without dying? Oh, skills. <laughs> skills. <laughs> oh, that's that's good times. Uh, do we need to... We, we should probably selfie this right here. That's, that's awesome. All right, screenshot. <coughs> oh, wait, did it work? 
There it goes. Okay. All right. Well, let's keep going this direction. Whoa. Living on the edge. Isn't that an Aerosmith song? Living on the edge. It's got that one foot going. Got that, got that one good foot. <sighs> we need more secrets. I love secrets. I wonder if I can just walk around the entire outside. Around the outside. Hmm. The stars are pretty. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Okay. There's nowhere to go from here, is there? All right. Void kill. There's the end, end, end times zone over there. And I'm not going to be able to see anything this direction. This is yeah, completely dark. Now hold up. That still doesn't have any leaves on it. I could have sworn. I wonder if that's a. I wonder if there's an end times tree up there at the top of the, the volcano. How much time we got? We're at 16 minutes. We've still got 15 minutes to find a tree. Oh, come on. Just get in there. There we go. Lights. Wait, are you going on my base? Oh no, he's going to his own base. All right. Hmm. Making my way downtown, moving fast, and I'm homebound. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Well, what's up, dude? Hey, Suski. I heard a ding. Was it the ding? Was there a ding on there? A oh, ding. That's well, my dad. Hi, dad. Oh, you sent me a funny. Nice. Uh oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Uh, I'm hoping that the fog will go away soon. That way I can see better. Nothing over there, nothing over there. No hunting. By the way, if you happen to see a spook tree and I did not, put in the time down below. And to the person that said, Code, you missed one, and you put a time, I looked all over that thing. You lied to me. It wasn't there. <laughs> All right, we're starting to get a clearer view of the entirety of the area. The uh, the fog is going away, is what I mean. Uh, fog's about to come back in full force because the volcano it actually has a red fog. I call it fog. I don't know if it's actually called a fog. Uh, distance uh, I, objects become covered with the uh, the color. Like, oh, it just jumped off the back of my truck. No end times trees. Yeah, it was just a regular old lava tree. But uh, for those of you who were asking, lava trees are the way to go. You can grab like two of these things, chuck them down, get them all into... I, I think I can get three into one car. Into one ball hauler. I kind of wanted to do that. Instead of, uh, instead of trying to find a, a spook tree, I'm going to show you how to do some lava wood. Let's do that. And hopefully I'll, I can find a spook tree tomorrow or something. <gasps> Where's my axe? Where is my axe, Defaultio? I know I had a void kill. If I jump off into the void, I don't lose my axe, right? That's, how, that's the way this works. Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Actually, shall we... Oh, gosh! I'm sorry, bud. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Super. Let's 
skills. <laughs> skills. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Now, shall we uh, skills this a little bit more? Hold on. So I used to be able to move this thing by wiggling back and forth and opening the door and everything else. There it goes. I don't know. It, it's been a while since I've glitched the bridge. Ooh, that was a big push. That was a big push. All right, here we go. Oh, there's another big push. Back it up just a little bit, and push, oh, push. That didn't work. All right, gotta have that leverage. Push. Um. Oh. <gasps> you know what else I could do? Hold on, hold on. I didn't even think about this. But what about opening up the back? Can't open it from here. Hmm. All right. Can I get turned around here? I have an idea. Okay. If I rotate this, it should put me into the rock. Nice. <laughs> boom like break dancing with my cars that was fun so if you don't happen to have uh, TNT but you have a Valhalla there you go that's how to drop the bridge I'm gonna go take a look at the uh, swamp and then I'm gonna call it a night because I'm tired and it, it like this was supposed to be a fast video, but I don't know. I'm having fun, just plain. Um, was there something in the comments I was supposed to read? Hold on, I'm gonna pause. Hey, code, I've been having terrible pneumonia. Watching your videos really makes me feel somewhat great and at ease. I hope you're having a nice day. Not gonna lie, love the hair. Hey, just a tip about the blueprints. It, you can turn twice and it flips you up the right way instead of rotate, then turn. Hope this helps. Thanks. Hello, Heath Haskins. Would you prefer a star code or a live streamer icon badge? Um... I don't have a preference. If they give me a star coat, awesome. If they give me a streamer badge, awesome. I mean, put it this way, I've I've never needed recognition for things. I like recognition for things, and it feels really nice when people are like, hey, you wanna be a Discord partner? Yes, yes, I do wanna be a Discord partner. Or they say, hey, uh, we're making a book, and we saw that you program, you wanna write a book? <laughs> yes, I do want to write a book. I mean, I had no intention of ever becoming an author. I didn't do really well in school, and I had no reason to make a book. But I looked at it and thought, this is an opportunity that I can go and create something that I, I actually don't like. I don't like books. I don't like reading. Here's a difference to that. There's there's a caveat. I love instruction manuals and programming language books. They're thick. They're like big, right? They're big books that take a really long time to read, but I use them more like reference manuals. So, uh, anyhow, sorry, ADHD is taking off with me. 
the reason I took the opportunity for the book is because Rebecca, uh, my publisher, she actually reached out to me on Facebook, on uh, Messenger. And she's the one, like, I thought it was a scam at first. I literally was about to block her, and I thought, no, I'll have my wife check out the profile and stuff. And it turns out she actually worked for Adams, uh, Adams Media and subsidiary of Simon & Schuster. Oh, wow. That was cool. So, um, once I actually got into it, I like making books. I like making instructions. I like making tutorials. I like teaching Maybe that's what I should be. Should I retire out as a teacher? That'd be fun. Whenever I'm done working for the corporation that I work with. Whenever I'm ready to move on. Retire. We still got a few years before retirement code. I know. But, uh, videos. I don't think I'll ever stop making videos. The channel might change. It might move on to something else. Might get banned. Who knows? Stuff happens. Life happens. And you know what? It's okay. Life will keep going on. And, oh gosh. And, <sighs> stop taking yourself so seriously. All right? Stop taking the world so seriously. It's supposed to be enjoyable. Okay? That's, that's one thing. If there's one thing I know about life, all right, the big question why are we here? Where did we come from? Right? Those are questions that I, I don't have an answer for you. And you probably have your own answers. But to enjoy each other, to live, and to, to, to live. That's, that's it. You must live. One of the things that me and my wife talked about whenever uh, she was going through chemo and cancer and all the treatments and stuff... Um, one of the biggest things that we had talked about was the fact that she doesn't, she's not going to chemo and she's not going to radiation uh, to die. She's going because she needs to live, right? So if you're being really safe and not doing anything, and sticking to yourself, and not going out, and that's not living. Like, if you're enjoying yourself and you want to be a hermit, that's fine. But to get out there and live, to go enjoy the sunshine, to walk outside, to meet with a friend for some coffee, to enjoy a cup of coffee by yourself. <sighs> Sorry. I'm getting all deep and philosophical. And we ain't got time for that. This is Roblox. We gotta get. I don't even know where my base is. Hold on. Is that, was that my base? <laughs> it's right next to my base. I'm just driving off. Uh, all right, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Eating some candy? Some candy, candy. All right. Hi, guys. <gasps> Hi, Grammy. Hi. Oh, my gosh. I love your avatar. Love it. That is awesome. And who has, who's joined us here? Ses Seski. What's up, bro? You are the one that was riding on the uh, jet ski. Or the, the snowmobile. <laughs> oh, wave. Oh, so e slash wave. Hi. <laughs> uh, what is this? Is this from last year? The Rusty Pickaxe? I need an end time zack. Hi, Jules. Oh, my gosh. Why is everybody showing up? Uh, he was whipping that truck. <laughs> so C code. Thought so. Uh, you know me? Uh, did anyone see a spook tree before I end the video? It's 29 minutes. We're good. Hey, Robox Locus. Okay, you messaged me, but like, I don't know where you're at. So we'll, we'll get together. Talk to me. Send me a message. Let me know what day. So, yeah, I didn't see it either. So, all right, guys. Let's, uh, let's go get an axe. Because I can't do the outro without an axe in my hand, right? Man, my nose is oh, getting all kinds of clogged. All right, here we go. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins. Code Primate. There we go. 
I'm outroing now. <laughs> They're all. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna get raided. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Alright, let's stand side by side. Line it up. Line up, line up. Everybody line Everybody line up. Line up, line up. Everybody line up. It's time to go outside. Line up. Line up. Sorry, that's bubble guppies. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's some of those songs just amazing thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me Heath Haskins Code Primate don't forget to like comment subscribe down below do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does but it's your choice if you want to go for it if not that's cool too you were here you watched you had fun I love you for that have a great night we'll talk to you very soon oh, my voice got deeper wow testing one two Wow. Outro. Oh, I still got the intro. Okay, hold on. There we go. Outro.